this is uh, like something uh, that I wanted to do for a very long time and uh, I wanted to in fact uh, learn about this book uh, the book for deep learning from Anne Goodfellow and the thing is um, as happens with most of us I tend to leave it for afterwards and so on and sometimes didn't um, pay much uh, I, I should say didn't put much time or effort into that but now I realized one thing that uh, you learn something the best way is to start teaching it so I thought of that I haven't seen any uh, dedicated you can say YouTube list that is trying to teach that book and this is like a very good book for deep learning and I thought that let's uh, learn it together so that um, um, if someone wants to just hear it like an audio book or just want to go through it various uh, resources that I'm going to use to learn about it because I'm going to learn it like a beginner and um, that's why so this is my first video and I'm trying to figure out a way maybe if a couple of first videos might not be that good but as the time will go on we will keep on uh, improving so uh, first uh, let's go to the URL uh, the URL is deeplearningbook.org so if you re go there it's a free version of the book and you can see basically they have not given a PDF but um, all of their chapters are available and you can start learning uh, them uh, through this website so if I click the first link uh, where I'm going is table of contents it will tell us and basically it's a, a PDF version uh, and the good thing is uh, although uh, I'm not supporting it but if you do control P and print it then it will take some time and then you can just uh, save this as a PDF but of course it won't be like a full book PDF it will be the PDF of only the pages you are looking right now I'm not supporting it I'm just giving you an option because sometimes uh, you are traveling and you not may not have access so you might save some of the pages before traveling so where, or going somewhere where you don't have any access to the internet so uh, again going back to the table of contents you'll see there there uh, there are many things um, that this book covers for example it covers who should read this book the historical trends with deep learning then the thing I like is about the prerequisites that you should have for the deep learning so here you can see we have applied maths uh, and machine learning mathematics like linear algebra probability information theory numerical computation machine learning basics then we delve into deep neural networks like modern practices what are different techniques regularization optimization cnns and methodology and then research auto encoders all i mean this this book is um, something like like a heaven for people who want to be into deep learning so without uh, wasting too much of time and this is about acknowledgement i think uh, we don't need to cover this at this point uh, notation again I don't want to go into details because we don't want to remember anything the things will be clear as we keep on uh, moving through the book for example there's a scalar a vector matrix and everything there's so many notations it is impossible to remember them so I think the easier way would be to go through them and come back to this uh, page if we need to come back because most of the time it will be uh, self-explanatory all right so uh, I'll stop here uh, in the next video I uh, will start talking uh, about the chapter wise and we will cover it chapter wise so that um, um, uh, there, there is like a playlist for every chapter uh, this was an introduction just to give you an uh, idea that what I'm going to cover please um, uh, put your comments if you would like me to continue this uh, and of course when the first video comes for the chapter one then you might see how good or bad that would be because right now even I'm not aware of this, how I'm going to approach this type of uh, thing because I want to learn it and this is a very good way of doing it alright so I'll see you in the next um, uh, video thank you